<clears throat> hey guys, it's Archie, so we're back with some more Tomb Raider anniversary. We're gonna be going into the next level, so let's go. This level is pretty lengthy and probably one of the harder levels in the game. I've acquired new evidence that leads me to believe it is the skill itself that is in some strange way a vast library of information to rival even Alexandria. I am now convinced that if I can obtain it, I will finally discover what happened to my beloved Amelia. Oh, Pierre, you litter bug. So here we are. The iconic pose. Just playing this makes me want to remake so badly this second one. Alright. <laughs> Natla doesn't honor her contracts, Pierre. I'd move on if I were you. No, mademoiselle. Natla and I understand each other. I find things for her, and she rewards me handsomely. But you see the very thing she does. That is why you are not trusted. I trust my instincts. And that is why you are a second place. I am proficient, mademoiselle. I focus on the job, and I get paid. There's more to life than money, Pierre. This isn't life, mademoiselle. It's business. Your compulsion prevents you from seeing the difference. It hasn't prevented me from getting a piece of the scale. How's business for you? Touché. So then, why don't we see whose compulsion gets them the next piece? Okay. So, as I said earlier, this is a pretty lengthy level. Um, there's also like two trophies in this level that you can get, and we have six art six artifacts to collect. So let's start. The first one's actually in this very room. What the heck? So one of the trophies is beating the entire uh, puzzle later on completely uh, without dying, which is very tricky considering how lengthy it is and how easy it is to die in a lot of sections. So definitely something that they made tricky for us. first artifact is actually in here, where you see this, we're gonna have to be um, unlocking some stuff to unlock this particular gate, but it's not too hard, in my opinion. But first, let's go this way. We also have a new technique that we'll be doing now, which is just wall running. The Greeks had an affinity for heavenly bodies. So I already know the thing for it, if I'm not mistaken. Why the heck isn't- oh, because I'm on it. I'm dumb. That's why. So let's- the heck isn't it? Okay. I'm having so many issues with this. Okay, let me let me double check here, cause ah, oh, God, I'm already having problems when the game just started. I thought I knew. Apparently 
Oh, I missed one. That's right here. There we go. Yeah. So, this is the puzzle that you need. I'll show you where the puzzle is located, but this is what you need to shoot in order to open up the, the, uh, the little artifact. In case you want to do it on your own, I'll show you where the location of it is. And then if you do this one, at least the left and the sword, we'll be able to unlock something here. Okay, so now if we do this... Oh, did I hit the wrong one? I did hit the wrong one, gosh darn it. There we go. We're gonna open that. And then it's gonna reveal which one the next one's gonna be. And here's the next one. So it's the two legs, the bottom middle, and the arm on top. So let's go back. Holy crap, why? Why is this happening? What the heck? Why won't it activate? It's crazy. Oh, there we go. Jeez. Alright, there we go. I don't know why it won't activate the other way. Alright, so we did that. Now let's break this thing. Yay! I'm gonna let that fall. I think there's gonna be more animals to kill once we come down here. Okay, well I thought that were. I guess we're fine for now. Okay, now I'm gonna want to climb up here. And then we're gonna go here to get to our gate. I'm thinking there's like way more. Oh, there's something in there. Maybe they come out after I open the, the thing. I don't know. I'm pretty sure they come out. Do it. Anyway, oh, whoops, sorry. Why does that keep happening? Let's continue on. So 
put it through here. It's gonna activate that gate. Now, as a little fun fact, the secret is right here. So this is to open up the artifact. So you see how troublesome a little bit? Because we have to go all the way up. So that's why I wanted to do that first. You already know it. it makes it a little easier. Alright, let's go. To the horrid level. It's not too bad, but it is kind of annoying. You have to go into four separate doors, and like you have to do a lot of climbing to get to each door. It's kind of a bummer. And then like you have to go through so many booby traps in each section. It gets very frustrating very easily. Alright. And you have to open up the switches in order to activate the doors. And it gets very annoying very fast. Alright. Um... So I'm gonna try and unlock that first switch over there. We're going this way. There's also a um, an artifact in here, and then after that, the only artifacts there are are the artifacts that are in the um in each door. Each door has an artifact. Poseidon. Like stuck or something. Let's jump over here. Activate. But I don't want to deal with them later. Okay, so we opened up one side. And in order to get to this side, we're gonna have to do that. And then once we get down there, we'll be able to climb up and open up that lever. So, in order to get our little secret, which I think here, let's go um, down here. Let's jump here. Then not miss this jump. And then we're gonna come down here, and then go down some more. And I believe if we continue on this path, we'll get to the relic. I mean the. I'm sorry. The. Yeah, there it is. The artifact. So there you go. So you can see how annoying this place can get just based off what you're seeing already. Did get to that one? Did I shoot that? Oh, it did. Sweet. Alright. But the other one didn't work. Stupid. Alright, let's go back over here. I'm trying to think where I want to go now. I'm gonna try and not die. I can't say I'll succeed, but I'll try. I'm gonna take this path. No, like I'd better. I'd rather climb my way up. Oh, there's a there's a lever here. Nice. That's very useful, actually. Yay. So obviously based off what they are, based off which god it is, it can tell you pretty much what you're going to be experiencing in each room. And see, we, in each room we're gonna have to, uh, keys, we're gonna put the keys in there, and that's what will unlock each section. Let's go open up that- oh. So I should just switch my gun to this and start using it, because apparently I'm not. So let's go up here. Open up yet another thing. To start going through the doors. The last one is all the way at the top, which we need to get to a certain part anyway to get up there, so we can just start doing the doors for now until we reach the top as we go. Alright, um. Hopefully, I don't die. That would be actually really nice if I don't die doing this. I doubt it'll work, but you never know. The other trophy that's in here, there's a room that's a lightning room, and if you don't get struck by lightning, you get a trophy for doing that, which is pretty nice. Okay, now I just gotta figure out how to get- let's figure out how to get to this door. Doesn't really give us much to work with here, so I guess we'll just jump here. I guess we'll go to that door first. I think the other door has a little bit more- more difficulty towards getting to it. Hopefully it's not the lightning one. Lightning one's actually like my least favorite one, to be honest. They're all kind of annoying, but whatever. Alright. Poseidon. Poseidon is water, right? If I'm not mistaken. So, 
the water one's actually pretty fun. It's the rock one I don't like. There's there is a rock one that's very annoying. Okay, so these things, what they do is they rise. And then you have to prepare yourself for the jump. And usually on the third strike it it um does the thing, so. Let's go. Yeah, it is the water one. Oh heck, why am I using shotgun shells on the I'll switch back. I'll switch back. Alright, so yeah, so this is the water one. It's pretty cool. Yeah, this is what I was looking for. <laughs> Alright, let's go in. Hopefully I don't have as much trouble as I did the last time I was underwater. Yeah, I can make it <laughs> without wasting my three health packs. Here we are. So the goal of this area is to pretty much rise it to the top. But first, let's get our little artifact. It's a very easy grab. There's just a little lever down here. There you go. Now we have the artifact. Let's come up. If she decides that she wants to come up. Sometimes she doesn't want to. And there you have it. So that's artifact number three. Alright, and in order to do this level, what you have to do is you cover the fish heads with boxes to make the water stop flowing, or you let it flow to make it go higher. But our goal right now is to first make it flow. Because we want to get to that other box. You know, you can push that lever and do stuff with that. Just leave that there for a second. Let's open up this. That will help us get to, the, to where we want to go. Oh, why I went in when I'm going over here, so we're gonna knock this box down. That'll just get us to cover the other fish head so we can go all the way to the bottom, fix the raft, and then we'll make it rise again. Look at that. So great. Alright, now let's go down. Apparently I'm having issues closing this thing. Heck. I want it maybe I don't know, maybe I'll like a difference if I do it like that. I don't, I don't know why it would, but you never know with this this game. What the heck? Okay. I don't know why that was so complicated, but it was. Okay, so now we have to move the raft in a way where it's not going to um, bother us. I think there's an easier way to get down, but I made it way more complicated. So our we need it to be able to be right there. So what we have to do is we have to move it over there without it getting hit by anything, though. Which it will. Okay, I'll be careful. If it gets hit by something, we're gonna have to do this all over again. Oh, we can put it here and then move it once we get up again. The, this is the way I was supposed to climb down, but I chose not to. So now let's unblock the water. Now we gotta use this area. Go like that. Now I gotta 
to climb up again. Oops. Hmm, I hope the raft doesn't hit that, which I think it's going to. Oh, that's annoying. There we go. I don't know how I managed to do that, but I did. Please don't hit it. Hey, cutie. Oh, perfect. Exactly where we want it. Oh, hell. Oh, hell. Okay, let's try and move it a little bit. I guess this line's exactly where I want it. I thought it was a good spot, but apparently not. What the heck, woman? Missing anything, right? Like, that's definitely where I'm supposed to go. Oh, okay, now you decide to climb it. Alright, crazy. Whatever you say. So now we got our first key. Three more to go. <laughs> Okay, so there we have it. And the cool part is when these extend, it makes it a little bit easier to roam around. Okay, I guess we'll do it from a different side because it doesn't want to from where we currently are. Definitely need that down if I want to do stuff. There we go. Oh, I did already. I forgot I already hit it. Hey, stop that. Alright, um. I think this is the route that leads to. It does. So let's actually. Let's open up all the doors so we make it a little bit easier on ourselves. Oh god, I thought she was about to fall off. Because it counts if you all fall off in here. You have to beat the entire level pretty much without dying. Imagine doing this on time trial, oh my god, I guess what we'll be doing it, so. You really gotta plan out everything pretty well. Yay! Alright, so I'm gonna go back down the other way, because I don't like going down that well. I'm gonna go down this way, it's safer. Alright. I just gotta think where I wanna go next. There is another door right there. I guess we could start there. Oh god. Oh god, that's scary. Oh, heart attack. There we go, woman. I'm gonna move myself just in case. <laughs> Closer to that. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this with patience. Or at least as much patience as I can as I can do. Oh 
okay, she didn't grab. She didn't. That's so unfair. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Like, stuff like that happens, and you're like, what the crap? But now it's the checkpointed at the door, so we have to do it all over again. I would checkpoint this here. But still, it's not frustrating. Like, I totally didn't actually die. Guess our bats are gone. Well, at least now I don't have to care about dying. But still, I was, I was really hoping I could get that. Alright. Let's try that again. I don't understand why she didn't grab the ledge, but whatever. She was supposed to. I like I've died there before, too. That exact section. For some reason, it's glitched there. I don't understand why she didn't just grab. See? I did the exact same thing last time. It's so unfair. Whatever. Let's go. So some of these gates instantly drop when when they go up, just as a warning. Oh, this is gonna be the lightning one. Yeah, so this one doesn't want us to... This one just breaks. But it's okay. We easily fix it. Frustrating level. Sounds like the lightning one. It is. Alright. So pretty much what you have to do here is you step on the areas that are low. And you pretty much just get to the other side. Wait, what the heck? Oh, you have to press the buttons, that's right. to get through though. Almost there. There we go. Yay. We should have got a trophy for that. Why didn't it trophy us? As far as I know I didn't get hit by the lightning. It's weird. Whatever. Um so there is a thing of a bomb right here. It's weird that it didn't trophy us. It's actually bothering me. Worked pretty hard to do that. Maybe it'll trophy us later, I don't know. <gasps> oh god, I forgot that that happens. Do is we actually have to get this thing to hit us and then climb up. I will come back, but I first want to get our thing. I do want that health pack on the other side. I will. I am going to try and get it. Have to go back through the electric again. I don't want to, you know, I don't remember if the electric current stops or not. It would make sense for it not to, but. Yay. Yeah, we probably have to go back through it. That's, that's why it's being like that. So we got the Hepus, Hepus, whatever his name is, key. Let's go get our health pack. Oh. Alrighty then. Jeez. 
like barely made it. We got it. Alright, so we have to go through this again without being hit. Yay. That time I should have gotten the trophy. What the heck? Maybe I'll get it once I leave the door area. Like once it registers that beat this section, I don't know. Or maybe during the cutscene I got hit by it, technically, because I technically did. Whatever. It just didn't like register, but I guess it registered for the game. But I didn't take damage. Oh wait, I did get it. Oh, thank goodness. One less thing I had to worry about. Alright, let's see. We need to get that door over there, but in order to do that, we're gonna have to go through that. So let's climb up. I'm so upset that I that that that, that part like completely ruined my chances. Like what if I haven't like what if I don't die from here on out? It's we're so upsetting that over that that I lost my chance to Come on girl, get up. Um, so I am just gonna do this door because then all I have to do is just have to go down for the other one wherever that one is located. That one is located where the where the boxes are. It's way lower, so just so I'll just happily do this one, and then that way we'll, when we finish, we'll already be over there, so we won't have to try too hard. FYI, that is a death trap if you don't land that jump. Um, you can do it different ways. You can do it backwards, but then she'll kind of come backwards. You have to like force her to go forwards. It's weird. Not a fun jump. Okay. Let's see what's this store for us now. I'm actually almost out the level. We just got two more things to go. Nothing too bad. Random way to take damage, whatever. Is this the swords one? Oh no, it's the rock one. I, I hate this one. It's my least favorite one. So, there is a rock at the end of this, and it will fall on you, and you have to pretty much. Just jump here, jump there, jump up there before the thing crushes you, and it's very difficult to do, actually. I was hoping it would trigger. Oh, okay, to trigger it. Oh, it triggered one side of it. And there's the other side, so hopefully we make it without dying. Okay, we- no, we didn't make it. You see what I mean? That's- that's what makes this, um, this whole- going through the whole trials without dying very difficult. It's this exact- this section is what makes it so annoying. Other than that, honestly, it's very doable, but... Alright, I'm just gonna stand, like, right here. I'm gonna try to trigger that side first. And I'm gonna stand as close as possible to this other thing so that we can still get it. There we go. Okay, we got it this time. Yay. Oof. Harsh, right? Why is my angle weird? Okay, there we go. Okay, now you see that we have the artifact on the other side, so we're actually about to go do that. Um, the, you can only get the artifact after the ball rolls, because what the ball does is it breaks this pillar. And then we can go get the artifact. Yay! One more to go, and it's gonna be in the last room. It's not a tricky one. There you go, do nothing again, controller. No, I do not want to quit. Not when I'm this far. Alright, 
One more key, big boy. Uh, something I'm supposed to trigger. Uh, maybe it's this. Something I didn't do. Let's come up here and see if there's maybe a, like a lever or something. Oh, there is. I see it. I was too excited about the artifact the first time. Oh, maybe I have to do the other one too. Yeah, there's two. That ah, makes sense. So you can see why this uh, this level could be very frustrating for the no dying concept. Um, like I said, we're like 36 minutes in right now. That's a lot of chances to die. Oh yeah, you got it. Yeah, see, that's what the pulse was. I was wondering. It's like, what's the point of this thing again? All right, let's go to the swords one. It's the last one we have left now. Atlas. Alright, so the swords one is right across, but we're gonna have to, to go this way to get up there. Alright, so... Yes, that just happened. understand how this is beneficial to do anything. I'm not really seeing another way up there. I gotta look at it. Oh, there are over here. Okay. There's other ways to get over there. Okay, so never mind. We don't even need to. Unless you want the shotgun or whatever, the health pack down there. I don't think it's worth it personally, but it's an annoying climb. I'm not gonna go for it because, as, as desperate as I am for health pack, I'm not that desperate. The game actually supplies you with a good amount of health packs, so. So. Let's get over here. Oh, uh, I guess I have to. Dang it. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. Oh. Okay, well now I at least don't feel bad knowing that I died somewhere else. I don't think I got the health pack now though. It's a shame. Yeah. I do want that first one. I don't care about the second one that much. what the point of that is, but it's- oh, I see how you get it. I think we can get the second one, actually, without it being too annoying. Place this over here. You push this one forward. Or back, I should say. You climb on top. You climb over here. Just enough for you to be able to do that. Let me go down here. There's your health pack. Okay. Wasn't too awful. Okay, now let's just get down without 
killing ourselves. Alright. How have we done this one? We totally have. Why isn't the thing spread out though? Is this oh, maybe we haven't done this one. I don't know. No, we haven't. Oh, okay, perfect. I thought the one we need was above. Or higher up, I should say, but I guess not. The weight of her is too heavy, so you have to use the box to get across. This is another pretty interesting level. So there are swords, and you don't want to get hit by them. Long story short. I don't know if they trigger yet. I think they trigger after you get the key. And the artifact, just so you guys see, is right up there. Okay, so let's get this real fast and run for our lives. That's why. So now if you run in those areas where the swords are, you will, um, you will die. <laughs> like, it'll hit you pretty hard. Alright. Start doing our thing. Hey. I thought that was going to be a pretty, pretty nifty jump, but apparently not. Alright, so the artifact is right here. But we need to unlock the source to do that, and there will be a place where we'll be able to do that first. Let's go this way. Makes it a little bit easier to get around. Yeah. Usually what I like to do is I like to knock them down as I you know, walk around or whatever. Makes it a little easier to handle them. Most of the other ones are on the other side. Okay, so you have to go through this pattern that they have here for you. You go on the white, pretty much. And die, like I just did. You have to go fast. You gotta go fast. Alright, let's try it again. Didn't make it on time. Oh god. Oh, I forgot about the sports. I forgot that they come straight at you. I'm sorry, guys. We're on the last key, though. We're almost done. Alright. Jeez. No, no. No, yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Bad idea. Imagine doing this in real life. Oh my gosh, I'd be so scared. I don't think I would trust myself enough to be able to do this. Yeah, I had a feeling there was one like right here. Come on, drop. <sighs> That's so frustrating. There it goes. Is there any more on this side? There is. Come on. There it is. Okay, I'm trying to get them all so I don't go through here again and kill myself. Oh 
god. Alright, is that all of them? Oh, okay. Holy crap. That scared me. I think now that's all of them. Okay. Good. Uh, let me just double check. Okay, yeah, we're good. Alright, so the whole point of um, this thing right here unlocking is so that we can climb up here. Climb up here. So now we unlock this thing, I'll actually unlock the artifact for us. There it is. Let's go get our artifact, and now both sides are unlocked, so we don't have to um, go through the swords. Just kind of do this. See, now all the swords are down, so I don't have to worry about killing myself. Very nice feeling. I'm surprised they didn't have more swords in the beginning part. They give you heart attacks, like, I almost, almost peed my pants there for a second. It worked that time. See, I knew it was possible. I think I can actually just jump straight for it. I can. So there we go. Now we got all the artifacts in this area. Alright, so let's run back around. Let's get out of here. I'm done with this, this level. Hey. Do your thing, Lara. I actually don't know if this is the right way or not. We might have to go to the swords, I don't remember. Precisely. I don't think we need to. Yeah. We're good. And we're not. Jake didn't want to grab on. That I understood though. I was a little too far to the right. At least we got checkpointed. So the artifacts that collected and everything. And the swords already fell. Cannot wait to get out of this level. Even though I'm gonna be doing it two more times at least. Gotta time trial it. Then I gotta um do the no dying thing. What the heck? Where the heck do I go then? Okay. Starting to get annoying. Oh, maybe there's a wall thing. I think there is. That's what I was supposed to do. Is there? Doesn't look like there is, and she's not triggering to anything. Where the heck do I go then? I was pretty sure you go up here, but I guess not. Uh, something would have triggered if I could go that way. I have to go that way, for sure. Hmm. The only other thing I could think of is this pole right here. Yep, it's the pole. You have to really angle this well for her not to kill herself. All right, like I did before. Just drop. All right. Let's get out of here. Gonna screw this level. Am I gonna beat it under an hour? I know. If I die, probably not. But if I don't die, then yes, we have the wheel. Yay! Thank goodness this is over with. Right, let's get the heck out of here. Hasta la vista, yo. Hasta manata. Thankfully we're actually close to the to the bottom, so we don't have to think too hard to get down. Thank goodness. That's over with.
In the original, there's like anthers down here. So I was like expecting no, there to be no. anthers. No, no. I don't have to pick the colors for you. Why can't you pick your colors? I don't know why, but it's not like moving. Oh. It's weird. Okay. Wait till we get to the final level. I mean, final world. Oh, gosh. The world gets very different. The, uh, in the, in the original, it looks so funky. Yay, we did it! Thank goodness. Thank goodness that's over with. Alright, so we did it. We got all our artifacts, as usual. Um, you'll be continuing in the next video 50, with 51 minutes of gameplay. Jeez. Alright, guys, so that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Outer Orange with some Tomb Raider Anniversary. This was the uh, St. Francis Foley in the Grease level with all our effects collected. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, do what I gotta do to make a girl happy, and catch you guys in my next video. Peace out.